Hi, this is Josh. I'm a pharmacist with PharmacistTips.com. Just going to cover uh, quickly blood sugar levels. I'm going to go over a chart that kind of shows you what ranges, uh, where your ranges should fall, that makes you consider diabetic or pre-diabetic or what normal blood sugar levels are. So we'll get right to it. Here's a blood sugar level chart. We've got a category for um, normal, pre-diabetic, and then diagnosed as type 2 diabetic. Keep in mind, any one reading does not diagnose you as diabetic. We're kind of looking at a general trend, and this is something <clears throat> your doctor would uh, help determine if you are diabetic. But typically when we're fasting, that'd be first thing in the morning uh, for most folks. You get up, you take a blood sugar reading. Normal ranges would be between 70 and 100 milligrams per deciliter. That's how we generally measure here in the U.S. Many other countries countries use millimolar per liter. That's uh, generally 3.8 between 5.6. Now you will see there's a popular keto diet now. Um, a lot of those folks will get below 70 and they seem to do just fine with that. I know I've tried it before. I've had readings below 70. It's not considered normal as um, that's not a state the normal population is in, uh, but typically that can occur. So you don't want to talk to your doctor if uh, you have a reading below 70 and you're concerned about that. Pre-diabetic uh, generally falls between 100 and 125 first thing in the morning. Depending on what reference, some references will have more like 110 to 125. Again, it's the different organizations have slightly different uh, recommendations as the category of pre-diabetic. But generally, somewhere between 100 and 125 is considered pre-diabetic, or 5.6 to 6.9 millimolar per liter. And then uh, generally, one is diagnosed as a type 2 diabetic when that morning or that fasting reading is 126 or greater or 7 millimolar or greater. Another important number is two hours after a meal. Uh, if you're normal, if you don't have diabetes, it should be 140 or less or 7.8 or less. Pre-diabetic category, you're going to be 140 between 199 or 7.8 to 11 millimolar. And then type 2 diabetics, it'll often be 200 uh, or more two hours after eating a meal or 11 millimolar or greater. Also, your doctor may order a test called an A1C. That gives an average of basically three months of blood sugars normal typically going to be considered six percent or less again there is some wiggle room in these numbers some organizations may put that a little bit lower at like 5.8 i think but generally six to 6.4 percent you're going to be in that pre-diabetic category type 2 6.5 or greater so uh when, when do you test blood sugar of course you want to have meaningful blood sugar readings you want to test fasting often first thing in the morning, two hours after eating, more as directed by your doctor. If you have, uh, if you're using insulin or if you're sick, um, often that warrants uh, checking several more times a day. That's something that you and your doctor need to talk about. I do appreciate you watching this. I hope you found this information useful. Go ahead and ask any questions in the comments below. I will do my best to answer them. Always, always, always talk to your doctor or your primary care provider with questions or concerns about your blood sugar. And subscribe to my channel if you appreciate these kind of videos. Thank you.